Welcome to this short introduction to our paper, Mining the History Sections of Wikipedia Articles on Science and Technology. If you are familiar with the Nobel Prize winning biotechnology CRISPR, you might also be aware of the science priority dispute surrounding it, particularly patent litigation by various parties. Science journals and magazines have reported on clashes over patents turning ugly, patent battles, and even CRISPR wars. Innovation scientists are interested in scientific priority disputes and how research credit is allocated. They look into the dynamics to identify key factors and dispute resolutions. They want to find out which researchers, institutions and companies are involved, who came first, who is making what kind of claims, and they want to assess and analyze accounts. Accounts can be divided into research accounts on the one and meta-accounts on the other hand. Research accounts are primary and secondary literature resources. The research and review papers you get from, let's say, a semantic scholar query. Editorial accounts are publications like news articles, reports in popular science magazines, editorial pieces in journals, as well as designated works detailing the history and development of a scientific field or technology. Collaborative accounts, like Wikipedia articles, have so far been largely overlooked, particularly history sections in Wikipedia articles on science and technology. Wikipedia as an account is interesting to innovation scientists owing to the fact that, unlike research and editorial accounts, the publication process is not one-sided but multilateral. Wikipedia is openly accessible, up-to-date, covers a wide range of topics and is available in multiple languages. We are therefore looking at two main tasks. One, finding articles on science and technology in Wikipedia and two, finding history sections within these articles. We are facing a few challenges here though. First, Wikipedia's category system, while helpful, is noisy and incomplete. Using it to find articles on science and technology will, in addition to articles about innovations, yield articles about people, companies and countries, in which we are not necessarily interested. Second, Wikipedia lacks consistent templates for articles, resulting in numerous different page types. An evaluation of 100 articles about people yielded 20 pages with a designated section biography or life, but also 80 with a person's biography split across sections. Third, articles often lack subdivision and consistent headings. Where many pages do have a section called history or origin, there are also many pages which feature the technology's history in less conspicuously titled sections. To solve these issues, we first iteratively filtered science and technology articles using Wikipedia's category network. We then selected designated history sections using section titles, and then used these sections to train classifiers in order to be able to find non-designated history sections. A first evaluation of 650 randomly sampled articles showed that a category-based article detection, if properly fine-tuned, can result in an explorative corpus of articles, more than 95% of which cover science and technology. Using a title-based heuristic to find history sections, while providing excellent precision, only yields around 70% of all history sections. In a second evaluation, we therefore first cross-validated 30 SK Learn classifiers with five optimization features, resulting in almost 2,000 setups, against more than 1,500 articles containing more than 8,000 sections. We then applied the five most promising classifiers and BERT to the articles without designated history sections, ending up with a pool of more than 1,000 articles. Labeling tells us that 615 of these do contain a history section and that using a classifier assisted approach can increase recall by almost 15% when using a recall based model or 5% when using a precision focused classifier. 
The corpus of almost 3,000 Wikipedia articles on science and technology is available on Zenodo. The corpus is annotated for designated and non-designated history sections, and we also provide a web service to browse the articles online. In addition, the experiments set up and model training can be reproduced by cloning the repository from GitHub. For more information, check out our paper. Thank you very much for your attention.